Well, good evening, Lupus Warriors. And I know that it's been a long time, but I promised you that I would return with more videos soon. And so tonight I'm not going to get in front of the camera. I am not dressed. But I said, let me pop in uh, with a short video bringing you guys some lupus facts on tonight. And so I hope that this video finds you all doing well. I have missed you all so much. Uh, life has been sort of busy. There's been some things going on uh, in which um, I have not had a chance or gotten around to making uh, videos for my Laura's Lupus channel, but Laura's Lupus and Support channel. But I want you to know that I've been thinking about all of you. I've been posting on my community page, you know, different information, uh, making sure to give you guys a greeting on Friday or Sunday or any day of the week. But uh, everything is okay. It's just that life has been sort of busy. And so on tonight, I have a question for you. Do you feel that lupus interferes with your work or that lupus interferes with your career? And if you answer yes to that question, then you are in the majority because 60% of lupus patients report that lupus interferes with their job performance. It interferes with their productivity or their effectiveness at work. Also, it interferes with their self-esteem at work. So 60% of lupus patients report that. Also, 7% of lupus patients report that even working part-time is difficult. Even working part-time is difficult. Did you know that 40% of lupus patients report that they have a hard time juggling, managing, work, home, and family stress? That it can feel overwhelming. Also, 40% reported that lupus has interfered with their ability to maintain positivity at work. And so that all makes sense. If lupus is interfering with your effectiveness at work, interfering with your productivity at work, if it's making you feel as though... Um, you know, you're not where you used to be as far as your work performance. You know, you feel that your work performance is not up to par. Or, you know, that you're finding it difficult or struggling to meet deadlines. Or that your coworkers or your supervisors are beginning to notice that there are some lapses in your job performance. And maybe they have mentioned that to you. So, of course, that's going to make you, you know, uh, find it difficult to remain positive while at work. A lot of lupus patients wonder if they have to disclose to their employers that they have lupus. And the answer to that question is no, you do not. You definitely don't have to disclose it to your coworkers or your supervisors because your personal medical history is not their business. But if you feel comfortable, you do need to disclose that you have lupus to management, upper management, or HR. If you don't feel comfortable actually giving them your diagnosis, you can tell them, hey, there's something going on with me medically and I'm going to need some additional support from you and my coworkers. Okay? So, it's up to you 
if you decide to disclose that you have lupus. Another fact is that most lupus patients feel that having family support and support at work is very important. So it's very important to feel supported by your family and by your coworkers. And last but not least, the majority of lupus patients report that being organized at home and at work is essential to their job performance. Being organized, having things organized at home and being organized on the job is essential to their job performance. And so that's all I have for you on tonight. Thank you so much for dropping in whenever you get a chance to listen to this video. Remember that, um, you know, I love all of you. I appreciate all of you. Continue to advocate and support one another. Also, as I always say at the end of every video, there is life after lupus. And remember that God loves you with all of his heart. And he has a plan, a purpose, and a destiny that involves you showing up as you. So stay strong, stay encouraged, and take care of yourself until we meet again on the next video. Bye for now, my friends.